Good morning, everybody. It is 10:43 in the morning, and it is 73 degrees. It's cloudy as hell out today. Uh, looks like it's gonna rain. It's supposedly gonna rain this weekend for Memorial Day, which kind of sucks because the family and I are going camping. Uh, we're leaving tonight, five o'clock, when my wife gets off work. And we won't be back till about 5 o'clock on Memorial Day. Um, then I start my new job on Tuesday. So, yeah. Yippee. No, I'm just kidding. We're going to treat, well, I am going to treat this camping trip like a 72-hour bug out. Um, so I have packed accordingly. Um, and you'll, you'll be able to see from what I've packed how much you really do need to survive for three days. I mean, you really don't think about it until you actually have to get ready to go ahead and do it. So, I once I have the truck all packed up, I will make another video of all the equipment that I am bringing um, just to go camping for three and a half days. Um, there's quite a bit of stuff. I mean, no guns or ammo or anything like that, but fishing equipment, camping equipment, food, water, essentials, I mean, you name it. There's a lot of things that you really need that you really don't think that you need until you actually pack for a situation like this. And, uh, I don't know, you'd be... You'd be surprised. You would be completely surprised of how much you actually need. A lot of people think they need like this three-day bug-out bag, uh, a couple canteens of water, a couple, you know, rashes of food, and ta-da, you got yourself a complete bug-out kit. Um, and, well, you don't. There's so much more that you need. So much more that you need. Uh... Oh, quick little update on my garden. I put onions here in the front. Put some more tomatoes in those empty spots there. Put some cayenne pepper in that empty row there. Planted some potatoes here. Everything else seems to be doing pretty good. Uh, my corn isn't up yet. But it's only been a couple of days. But it'll it'll be up soon enough. As long as the ground stays moist. Plus if it rains here this weekend, uh, it'll probably be up sooner than I think, but I will do a uh, video later on to let you see what it actually takes to try and survive for 72 hours outside of your house, uh, so you guys take care, and remember, stay safe, be safe, and uh, prep while you can.